Greetings ladies and gentlemen. So, following on from my last video, I've been playing around with black powder pistols just a little bit more. And my good friend Storvis has just put me onto something. If you take a look at this black powder pistol here, it looks totally normal, nothing dodgy about it. Until you do this. Mmm, yes, that seems perfectly normal, doesn't it? Definitely nothing wrong with that at all. We've also managed to do it with a black powder rifle. Mm-hmm, yep. Definitely functioning how it was designed to. Basically, what we've done is created semi-automatic black powder weapons. And I'm going to show you how I did it in just a second. So the way that I've done this is nothing revolutionary. It's a well-known glitch that's been being used for a while now. A lot of YouTube videos cover it and it's simply an ammo glitch. The difference is when you apply it to black powder weapons, it makes them into semi-automatic pistols and rifles rather than just adding extra ammo capacity to them. So what you want to do is get yourself a black powder pistol or rifle and you want to set your inventory up so that when you hit quick weapon swap with the D-pad on PlayStation, for example, it brings up a machine gun or something with a decent ammo capacity, like this, for example. What you want to do is when you hit swap weapon, click fire immediately after. So it may not work the first time. It does take a little bit of jiggery porkery, but you'll know it has worked when you see a bullet fire out the gun when you're swapping it over. It'll all make sense in a minute. Let's see if we can do it. Now, I don't know if you saw that on the last attempt at doing that glitch. A bullet came out of the pistol when I was mid-swap to the machine gun. That means the glitch has worked. You can now basically use the black powder pistol as a semi-automatic pistol. The only difference is the black powder pistols, if you watched my last video, do a decent amount of damage. So we've effectively got a really, really overpowered weapon here. Let's see how it does against some of the stronger wasteland creatures. I'm also going to throw some footage in of the black powder rifle in action too. As you can see guys, that thing is a pretty overpowered little weapon now. I reckon with pistol perk cards on there, it's going to be doing some decent amounts of damage. I hope you like this one guys. Like I say, it's not my glitch, it's been discovered before, but I've never seen it applied to a black powder weapon. And the results are rather interesting. Stay safe and have some fun.